Hi guys, welcome back. Question 11 here, another displacement type question. So with this question, what's happening is we are preparing an amoxicillin oral suspension. We need to add in 82 milliliters to get 100 milliliters of a 250 milligrams in 5 ml suspension. So we have our volumes of water, how much we're having as our final concentration and a strength as well but we need to work out the displacement volume for 125 milligrams. So what do we know? Got a drawing for you. We're adding in 82 mils into an amoxicillin bottle. We end up with 100 mils of that, and the concentration is 250 milligrams in 5 mil. Now we need to work out the displacement volume for 125 mil. So therefore, what we need to do is work out the total amount of amoxicillin that we have. So if it's 250 milligrams in 5 mil and we have 100 mils of it, then we know that 100 mils contains 5,000 milligrams. Please see step two. Now we know that 5,000 milligrams are inside 100 mil. We know that we have a total volume of 100 mils. We had to add in 82 so therefore, our displacement volume for that 5,000 milligrams is 18 mil. So if it's 5,000 milligrams per 18 milliliters, it'll be 125 milligrams, which is what the question is asking for, per 0.45 milliliters. That is to two decimal places. However, we need one decimal place. Therefore, our answer is 0.5 mils. This is correct because it's in milliliters and it is to one decimal place as well. Please have a look at the diagram to help develop your understanding of displacement. Thanks guys, see you soon.